Hi yogis, it's Tana here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you for being here and welcome to today's slow and strong rhythmic breath flow. Today we're focusing on moving slowly with intention and awareness through the whole body with an emphasis on breath, which helps still the mind, creating a meditative state. When you're ready, please find a kneeling position at the back of your mat. So you're welcome to sit up nice and tall and just place your hands on your thighs, lifting the crown of the head to the ceiling. Close down your eyes or soften the gaze and just find a few moments of stillness before we begin. Bring an awareness to your breath and then just find that steady flow in and out through the nose, soft and steady. And then very slowly blink the eyes open, roll over your knees, find a tabletop position. Inhale, arch your spine nice and slowly. Exhale, round in, contract, tuck your tailbone. Inhale to lift through your heart, push the shoulders down and back. Exhale, round in, contract. Breathing in, arch through your spine, lift the heart forwards. Exhale, round in, contract. Breathing in, arch through your spine, broaden through the collarbones. Exhale, round in, draw your navel all the way into your spine. And then curl your back toes under, find an active child's pose, reaching the arms out in front of you and spreading your fingers wide into the floor. Inhale to round forwards, open across your chest. And then exhale, glide your sit bones all the way back into that active child's pose once again. Breathing in as you round through your spine, unfurl forwards, lift your heart through between the shoulders. Exhale, arch the spine, glide your bottom backwards. And again, breathing in, round forwards. Unfurl, lift through your heart and the roof of your mouth. Exhale, glide your bottom all the way back. Spread your fingers wide, toes spread wide. Slowly make your way into a downward facing dog, stretching your tailbone up and back. Press into the knuckles of your hands and take a full breath here. On your next breath in, start to lift your heels off the floor and then exhale, lower them back down. We'll go for a few more rounds. Inhale to lift up. Exhale, ground the heels into the earth. Breathe in as you lift. Breathing out to lower. Find that length through the back lines of the legs. Breathing in here for a moment. And then lift your heels off the floor and slowly you ripple forwards into a plank position, really nice and slowly as if you're moving through honey with precision and control. Round through the upper back slightly. Exhale, hanging cobra, melt your hips closer to your wrists. Pull the heart through in between the gates of the shoulders. Find that expansion through your chest. Squeeze the thighs together, breathe in. Breathing out, downward facing dog, glide your bottom up and back. Take a full inhalation and we go again. Inhale to lift your heels off the floor, finding that plank pose. It's quite a high plank here. Exhale, melt your hips down, hanging cobra. Push firmly into your palms, lift up through the roof of your mouth. Breathing in. And breathing out, bend through your knees, downward facing dog, glide your bottom backwards. One last round here. Inhale to lift your heels off the floor. Slowly with ease and control, find that plank position. Hollow out through the armpits and draw your navel in. Exhale, hanging cobra. Squeeze your thighs together, keep the back body as active and engaged as possible. Lift the crown of the head to the sky. 
nice full breath. Exhale, bend your knees, glide back into a downward facing dog. Press firmly into your palms, relax through your face. And then breathing in, start to lift your heels off the floor. We'll spin our heels to the right, toes to the left, and then bend your knees a lot, sinking your bottom to your heels. Look forwards and glide forwards into a plank a side plank position. So you're on that right hand now and you're reaching out through the left arm. You're welcome to start to lift that left foot off of the right for a little bit more of a challenge. Stay active through your right hand and your shoulder. Breathing in. Beautiful. Slowly, if you can, come back into a downward facing dog. And then we'll take it over to the other side. So heels to the left, toes to the right. Sink back into your heels and then glide forwards to find a side plank on the other side. Lift your bottom hip upwards, so finding that engagement and activation. And if you did so on the other side, play with lifting that right foot off of the left. Stay well through the left hand. Breathe. Exhale, lower both hands to the earth. High plank. Hanging cobra melts your hips all the way to your wrists. Pull the heart through in between the shoulders. Once again, stay active through your back body. And then micro bend through your elbows, come all the way to the earth. Bring your hands out alongside the mat. Inhale to elevate your chest off of the floor. And exhale to come down. Keep your fingers spread wide. Breathing in, lift your heart off the floor. And exhale, melt to the earth. Inhale again, elevate the chest off the floor. Keep the back body turned on. And exhale. And then bring your hands beneath your shoulders, curl your toes under and slowly with control push up into a plank position. Exhale, downward facing dog. Okay, beautiful. Find your breath here. Notice the quality of your breath now. And breathe fully and deeply into your belly, into the sides of your waist. Sink a little bit deeper into the floor. Find the rootedness through your posture. And then send the right leg into the air, three-legged dog. Bend through your right knee and stay rooted through the left foot. Start to lift your left heel off the floor and then curl your knee into your nose, rounding through the upper back as much as you can. So really slowly here, gracefully landing the foot in between the hands if you can, Open up through the heart, finding a low lunge. Breathe in, collarbones broad. Exhale, long pyramid pose, fold over your right shin. Draw back into the left heel, feel the energy draw off the back of your leg. And then rock forwards back to your lunge. Breathing in, peel the right arm to the sky, easy twist. Reach up through the right fingertips. You're welcome to create a few circles here through that right wrist. And then softly lower the right hand back towards the floor. And we'll spin over to the left side to find Skandasana side lunge at the back of your mat. Hands together at the heart. Lift your chest slightly, breathing in. And then slowly, with as much control as you can muster, Skandasana to the front of your mat. Left leg is straight, flex your toes towards you. Skandasana to the back, nice and slow. And swivel all the way over to the front, find a low lunge, plug into your hands and step it back into a high plank. Chaturanga halfway down. Inhale, upward facing dog, open across your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Draw your tailbone up and back. Press firmly down to lengthen up. Breathing in, send the left leg into the air, three-legged dog. And then open up through that left side, bend through your knee. Stay
Slowly draw your knee to your nose, rounding in, hollow out through the armpits. And then as slowly and as softly as you can, ground the foot in between the hands to find a low lunge. Draw the hips forwards and down, pull the heart through, breathing in. And breathing out, take a long pyramid pose, folding over your left chin. Melt your chest a bit closer towards that left thigh, finding length through the back of your leg. Inhale, rock the body forwards, back to your lunge. Easy twist, peel the left arm to the sky, peeling all the way upwards. Feel the energy draw off both of your arms. You're welcome to invite some movement into that left wrist. And exhale, float the left palm back down to the earth and swivel all the way to the back of your mat, Skandasana, side lunge. Press your palms in towards one another, breathing in, breathing out, travel all the way to the front, Skandasana. Flex the right foot, toes pointing towards you. Skandasana to the back of your mat, slowly with ease and control. Travel all the way over to the front of your mat, press down through your palms, plank pose will take it back. Chaturanga halfway down. Inhale, upward facing dog, push into the floor through your palms, open across your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay rooted, stay present, and hug your front body to your back body. Breathe in fully. And then on the next breath in, start to lift your heels off the floor. Plank pose, ripple forwards. Exhale, hanging cobra, melt your hips to your wrists. Pull the heart through in between the gates of the shoulders. Stay active through your spine and your bottom. And then we'll pick that right foot off of the floor. Point your toes and draw your foot towards your sit bones. Slowly round in as you connect your knee to your nose. Round through the upper back and then softly land the foot in between the hands, low lunge. Breathe in across your chest, broad through the collarbones. Exhale, sink the left knee to the earth, float the arms up into the air. Inhale to cactus through the arms. Exhale, round and contract inwards. Inhale to expand and lift. Exhale to round. Inhale, arch the spine, spread your fingers wide. And exhale to round in. Inhale to expand across your chest. And then as you exhale, sweep the arms back up into the air, breathing in. Find a high crescent lunge rising all the way up. Drive into the left heel. Root into the right foot. And then take it to the side to find a warrior two. And without moving your feet, start to magnetize your feet together. Finding that energetic drawing down. Breathing in, reverse your warrior, reach the right arm up. Exhale, glide all the way back, find a rainbow warrior, straighten out through that right leg. Inhale. Inhale, reverse your warrior root through your front foot. Exhale, rainbow once again, glide backwards, flex through the right foot a lot. Inhale to rock forwards and reverse, expand through the right side of the body. And as you exhale, low lunge at the top of your space, plug into your hands and we'll find a three-legged plank pose, sending the right leg behind you. Optional chaturanga here, halfway down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. And take two connected breaths here. Root down through your fingers, through the toes, through the soles of your feet. Breathing in, lift your heels. Exhale, plank pose slowly. 
unfurl into a hanging cobra, your back toes are curling under, hug your thighs together, lift your sternum up and forwards, pick the left foot off the floor, and then draw that foot towards your left sit bone, bending through the knee. Exhale round through the upper back, knee to your nose. And then very slowly and softly land the foot in between the hands to find a low lunge. Breathe in across your chest. Sink the right knee to the earth. Inhale to sweep the arms upwards. Cactus through the arms, spread your fingers wide. Exhale to round in and contract. Inhale, open and lift through the heart. Exhale to round in. Breathe in, broaden through the collarbones, expand. Exhale, round in. Open through your chest. And then breathing in, sweep the arms back up into the air, finding length. Curling the back toe under, rise up into a high crescent lunge. Tuck your tailbone a little bit and draw your navel inwards and start to magnetize your feet together without moving them. Exhale, warrior two. Reach out through your fingertips. Breathing in, lift up. And breathing out, reverse your warrior, extend up and over. Keep driving into the edge of the back foot. Exhale, rainbow, take it all the way back, nice and low into the right leg. Inhale to glide forwards, reverse your warrior, reach up through the left hand. Exhale, glide back, rainbow. Breathing in, rock forwards, root the left foot into the ground, expand through the side. And then as you breathe out, windmill the hands to the floor, find a low lunge. Send the left leg all the way back, finding a three-legged plank pose. Slowly, chaturanga halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Draw the shoulders down and back. Exhale, tuck your chin, downward facing dog. Take a few normal breaths here, in and out through your nose. And then start to lift your heels off the floor, sink your knees into the earth and find a child's pose, Balasana. Melt your chest over your thighs and find a sense of spaciousness through the back line of your body. Breathing into the back rib cage. And slowly lift your gaze, glide all the way up, just place your hands over your thighs, lift up through your crown, and then slide your legs over to the right side, and find a cross-legged seat, just place the right foot in front of the left, inhale to sweep the arms up to the sky, and exhale, find a twist to your left side, right hand to left thigh, Place the left hand on the earth behind you. Find a sense of opening, a sense of spaciousness across your chest. Unravel, come back to center, inhale. Exhale over to the other side. And find a sense of length through your twist. Unwind, come back to center, and then place the hands behind you and push your hips forwards and up. We're coming into a bit of a back bend here. So your knees are grounded on the floor, your pelvis and your heart draws forwards. You have an option to gently drop your head back if that feels accessible, otherwise you can keep your chin tucked. Stay here for a few moments and stay active through your bottom and your legs. And exhale, softly land your sit bones to the earth. Come back into your seat and place the hands out in front of you. Take a gentle fold over your legs. 
find a bit of space through your back body and bow your head to the earth. slowly lift your gaze and then extend both of your legs out in front of you bend through your knees slightly reach your arms out in front of you and very slowly start to roll the spine all the way to the floor and then hug both of your knees into your chest wrap your hands around your shins draw your forehead to your knees and take a breath in And as you breathe out, find Shavasana. So spread your legs wide, hands out to the sides, palms facing the sky. Take these few moments to find some stillness. Allow the whole body to feel soft, to feel relaxed. Please stay here for as long as you need. Thank you so much for practicing with me today. I really hope you enjoyed this practice. And if you did, please remember to like and subscribe to my channel to support me. And let me know how you went in the comments below. Lots of love from me to you and I'll see you soon. Namaste.